Thank you. Mr. Speaker, I rise in opposition to this poorly conceived and deeply irresponsible legislation. This bill is a clear giveaway to oil companies that are already posting record profits, and it's a dramatic departure from the regionally targeted offshore drilling strategy that has led to domestic oil production rising to an all-time high. In fact, it's even possible that America will be the world's largest oil exporter within the next seven years. To most people, this would indicate that our current policies are working, but apparently not to the supporters of this bill. Instead, they think taxpayers should give giant subsidies to big oil at the likely expense of the economically critical tourism and fishing industries in many states, including my own. What we should be doing three years after the awful BP spill in the Gulf is passing legislation that would protect workers, coastal communities, and the environment from devastating spills. In the three years since that tragedy, Congress has yet to pass legislative reform to improve the safety of offshore drilling. I would hope, Mr. Speaker, that we will vote down this unnecessary giveaway to oil companies and instead take up legislation to respond to the BP oil spill and protect our coastal communities and workers. With that, I yield back. The